Hey guys, it's Comic Beast here with an unboxing for you. Um, it's actually going to be a double unboxing, doing things a little different as well. I'm in front of the camera this time. Have a little setup going, testing it out. Let me know what you guys think, please. Um, this box is from the Discount Comic Book Service. Um, I order from them. Most of my books, they offer really good discounts, about $35 off, 35% off. Um, but you have to order two months in advance. That's the only catch. Uh, they also have Funko Pops on there, which <clears throat> which is why this box is so large today. Um, I think they have about three in here, and I'm really, really excited to show you guys those. Um, I also have another box from In Stock Trades with three books that I ordered from there, and I'll talk to you about those when I get to them. Um, but for now, let's open this box up. Um, this box is some comics and, like I said, Funko Pops. I've been doing a lot of Funko Pop hunting recently, uh, trying to find some a lot of the exclusives, like the Hot Topic exclusives and the <clears throat> new Walgreens exclusives. Sorry if you guys can't hear me, and like I said, I'm doing a little makeshift setup. Um, please bear with me. But if you guys like this in front of the camera format, please let me know. Take this off as it has my name and my address on it. Just as I suspect, uh, expected, some Funko, the Funko Pops. Okay. Um, these are all the comics that shipped with it. Um, I believe there's some actual uh, Flash variants in here. They're doing those for his 75th anniversary. And they ship pretty well, each of them, in bags and boards. And <clears throat> they're actually in really good condition. Justice League, and Robin. See, another flash variant there for you. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna put these aside. <laughs> and now the Funko Pops. I ordered three. So they're from three different genres. So I'm gonna do one at a time. Um, this one's from. The Book of Life. It was one of my favorite movies that came out this year, animated-wise. Um, it was really good. If you guys haven't seen it or gotten a chance to see it, please watch it. It just came out on Blu-ray uh, this week as well. Um, we got the La Muerte. La Muerte, you would say, the uh, regular version. They also had a Hot Topic exclusive of her that glows in the dark. As you can see in my wall of Funkos behind me, I have the Manolo Remembered version. Um, this one I was really, really excited to see when I saw her. Excited to get it. Um, ordered it from them. <clears throat> I believe it was $7.95. and like They're regular $10, so I saved almost two. Um, the only thing is you don't get to choose your box or the pop. And the box is a little scuffed up, but I was just really, really excited to find her. Um, I haven't been able to find her in person at like Hot Topics or anything like that. So really excited to get that one. And the next one, another one of my favorite movies from this year is was Guardians of the Galaxy. Got my dancing baby group. Um, they put out a Hot Topic exclusive. I have a regular baby group, another one. Uh, I wanted one to open so you could bobble his head and dance. Um, they have a Hot Topic exclusive as well. I did get that one. And I'll be shooting another video for that. And last but not least... Another movie from last year, uh, Baymax, Big Hero 6. Um, I have the Amazon exclusive that glows in the dark, but this is the regular 6 inch show. So, I got this one for $12. But yeah, so I'm super, super excited about those. Um, that's it for that one. It's Discount Comic Book Service, in case you guys are interested. Maybe I'll, I'll put a link on the bottom of the video. This box. Another big box. This one's from InStockTrades.com. Towards the end of the year, they had a really big discount on Marvel and DC books, 45% off. Um, so I saw some stuff on there that I really, really wanted. And got it.
got them. One of them, I wasn't too sure about. I hadn't read anything about it. I had just heard about it when I saw it on their website. But I saw it in Barnes & Noble last week, and I was really excited to get it. And it's finally here. Unfortunately, that sale is no longer on, so they do offer really, really good discounts on graphic novels and hardcovers, about 35 to 40% off, so really, really worth checking them out. Okay, the first book I'm going to show you guys is an oldie, but I like it. It's a good one. Um, I didn't have it collected yet, but uh, Flash Rebirth. Uh, Jeff Jones bring back, brings back Larry Allen. I was really excited about this, really happy about this. He's my favorite Flash over overall. Um, Wally West, he's cool, had a good run, but I'm not going to say I miss him in the New 52. I like Barry Allen, the original. Um, the other book I got is the Omnibus of Young Avengers. It collects all, I believe, 15 issues on the point one issue of Young Avengers. It was a really, really good run, and I really, really love this cover. It was a variant for issue one. Oh my god, uh, Brian Lee O'Malley variant for issue one, and I'm glad they used this for the Omnibus cover. Um, it's not very thick, but it was only 15 issues, so it's not that bad. And Karen Gillan is also the author of The Wicked and the Divine, which is a really good image series if you guys haven't seen that. Um, the one that I was really excited about um, was this one. It's Jeff Loeb, Tim Sale, Batman Noir, The Long Halloween. <clears throat> the different thing about this is it's Long Halloween, which I have collected in the graphic novel form, but this is a hardcover and it's all in black and white. It, I saw this at Barnes & Noble opened, and it's really, really nice. Let me go ahead and open this up so I can show you guys. Um, I'm a big fan of matte finishes, and the hardcover itself is a matte finish, very flat matte finish. And inside, all the pages are also a matte finish. Um, I really like this because the glossy pages, you know, fingerprints and stuff like that. But this, it's all black and white, and it's matte finish, so you don't get any fingerprints when you touch the black. And it just looks really, really nice. Tim Sale, really awesome artist. Jeff Loeb, awesome writer. We all know that. Uh, Long Halloween was a great series, and I was really excited for that. Um, I got all of these for really, really cheap. This one, regular $49. $49.99, got it for $25. Um, Young Avengers, same thing, $49.99, and got it for $25 as well. Uh, the Flash Rebirth wasn't 50% off, but I believe it was 45% off. So $14.99, I think I paid 6 I think I paid 6 8 dollars for this, so not bad altogether. Actually, it says right here on my packaging slip, let me check it out. $8.24 for Flash Rebirth and $24.99 for everything else. The good thing I like about in-stock trades, um, I think believe they're a sister company of Discount Comic Book Service, but if you order over $50 in books, which this was, they ship it out to you for free. So if you're looking to make a big order, a big purchase of graphic novels, go with in-stock trades. Really good. I love Amazon to death because of free two-day shipping, but if I'm going to buy a bunch of books, I, I buy from them because they're usually a little bit cheaper, they ship for free, and I live in California, and they don't charge me tax. So that's pretty good. Um, so yes, thank you guys for joining me. Uh, again, I really love this book. <laughs> um, but thanks you guys for joining me. Comic Beast, Unboxing, In Stock Trades, Discount Comic Book Service. Check them out if you haven't already. Um, let me know what you guys think about this new format of me getting in front of the camera. And until next time, I shall see you guys. Thanks again.
Please like, comment, and subscribe.